Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Like I said earlier in the previous video that we were gonna get a bunch of snow this weekend. Well, we didn't get a ton of snow. We got a lot of ice and sleet and stuff. We got probably about four or five inches of snow, but I kid you not, not more than 20 minutes north of us, they got 13 to 15 inches of snow. So it, it just we just happened to be a little too far south for us to get all that like Western North Carolina foothill snow. We got some of the, I guess the Piedmont snow, but if you guys go an hour and a half east of southeast of here by like Monroe, North Carolina. I don't think they got any snow. So let's uh, show you what we ended up getting. And uh, we've already plowed the driveway a little bit. And guys, this is what we would call like heart attack snow up north. It's where old people would just drop dead from s s shoveling off their driveway. We got this real thick, heavy ice laden snow. I mean, it doesn't look like a lot, but it's just a ton. And uh, here's the truck. Oh yeah, I got it cleaned up a little bit. Actually, I need to go to AutoZone and replace one of the wiper blades. Clearing off the truck, I had the heat on. I accidentally bumped the uh, windshield wipers and the wipers stuck to the window and basically came unclipped from the housing that it's on. So that <laughs> wiper is broken. I've temporarily put it back together and clipped it back in, but that's not gonna be permanent. So I'm gonna go head up to AutoZone, go replace that. All right, guys, we're getting on to the main street here, and uh, you guys are gonna laugh, but my uh, temporary fix for the windshield wiper, yeah, that lasted about two minutes. I think I got maybe six swipes with the wiper, and uh, I don't, I don't think you can see in the bottom of your screen, but down here, the uh, wiper <laughs> came undone. So we're gonna head to AutoZone. And I hope that uh, they are open and have wipers. I probably should have checked, but if not, we'll do a temporary fix in the parking lot and uh, go from there. But the back roads have not been plowed, which is typical. And my street, <laughs> trying to power through it to get up. Uh, we've got a little incline in our street. Yeah, I couldn't do that. Couldn't get out of the street. So I ended up putting it four wheel drive low and uh, that got us out and then I'm still in four wheel drive high. I think you're supposed to be up to, four wheel drive high is like 20 and above. And we've been averaging about 20. And we normally, I get out of my neighborhood in like 10 minutes. Yeah, that was a solid 20 minute drive. So we're just taking it nice and slow. I don't know what you guys can see just because of the snow drops and whatnot on the windshield. But we'll try to resolve that at AutoZone and Hopefully, uh, fix that. So, woo. man, low lying area with a whole crap load of salt and sand and road crap grime in it. So, damn. <laughs> but, alright, guys, we will get to AutoZone eventually. They're probably not open, it's my thought. But. Lowe's is definitely closed. Oh, there's a truck at AutoZone. I don't know what that means, but... Alright. Wow, we made it, guys. That's a pretty steep hill, too. Alright guys, we'll uh, try to get a new wiper and go from there. All 
Alright guys, you just saw the uh, install of the windshield wiper. Nothing too crazy there. Now that we can properly see and <laughs> not uh, worry about hitting something. Let's head out. Oh, we're still in four high. Interesting fact. The truck will not change the two-wheel drive after you turn it off. I was not expecting that. Oh man, we got bobcats over here. That sucks. <laughs> All right, well, we still be an idiot over here. second time they've ever been able to use those down here. says uh, clean their parking lot. That sucks. Crappy bird. Alright guys, as you can see, we're back here in the shop. We made it home. We almost made it home <laughs> without any issue, but I was taking one of the back roads to my neighborhood and the road wasn't plowed at all and we were all kind of hugging the middle of the street. Well, there were a couple lifted pickup trucks coming the opposite direction, so what I did was I got out of the way. I, I went toward the edge of my lane and I slowed down, but when I slowed down, my truck literally slid into the ditch. I didn't realize when I was slowing down, I was slowing down into like a very drop off part of the road. And as soon as I stopped, the, tr the truck just slid right in the ditch. So thankfully the guys that were coming the opposite direction saw me like slide in the ditch. And like I said, I mean, I was going like one or two miles per hour and went, you know, and slid into the ditch. And thankfully they had toe straps with them. 
I tried to get out. I, I got out maybe, I don't know, I probably backed out like 15 feet and I almost got out, but you know, not quite. So thankfully the guys that had came, went past me came back, they had toe straps. They hooked up to the back of the Duramax, hooked it up to their truck and lifted me out. So one of those guys was Dustin Collins, 617. Go show him some love over on Instagram. I'll have the his Instagram tag down below. So head over there and show him some love, just kind of a way of saying thank you for getting me out of the ditch. Speaking of Instagram, if you guys didn't know, I am heavily active on Instagram. I'm always posting, you know, car stuff, whether it's related to my channel, automotive in general. You know, I'm always posting our stuff around the shop. You know, so we're always posting on there. And usually if you guys are on there, you will see kind of what's upcoming in the channel. I usually post that a little bit before the video comes out and give you guys a sneak peek of what's coming up. So make sure you should check that out. The link is in the description below. It's always in the description below for Instagram and any of the other social media. But beyond that, you know, it was a pretty good time. We got the wiper replaced and we finally got to go out in some snow. So on that note, we're gonna end this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed the shenanigans out in the snow, you know, doing what we do. So I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed, please do. If you wanna know when I upload new content, hit that bell notification button down below. And if you wanna help support the channel, as always, click the links down below. And also, don't forget, go out, show Dustin some love for helping a guy out getting out of the ditch. So thanks guys, have a great one.